Galactic Federation of Light Update, December 8, 2015. 4 Ik, 5 Yak Seen, 12 Manic. Selamat Jawa. Be an everlasting joy. An operation which is to give you a new world is now finishing. For millennia, your service reality has been limited in its perceptions by core lies and unbelievable deceptions. You are at least at the very edge of a different reality, in which you are surrounded by truth and new governance dedicated to your well-being. This is something that you are not used to. Rather, you expect to be lied to, cheated, or just plain deceived. Over the past few weeks, a new realm has been constructed. This world is more than a gift for this holiday season. It is to be a realm in which you can rejoice. This new realm is there, but not yet manifested. You are presently seeing it manifested before you. The dark is defeated, but not yet isolated from you. A final set of events needs to occur before this most wished for event occurs. This reality is being slowly transitioned, and when this is completed, some very clear signs are to appear before you. Until then, be both knowing and confident of this great change in your reality. Long ago, heaven decreed that this moment in your history was to happen. We are here to help implement those things, which are to make this complete. Heaven has given instructions about how this wonderful present is to appear. Already the signs of these numerous changes are in the air. We have watched as your many light groups have, all too slowly for us, prepared your reality for this grand shift. We feel they have been too lenient about isolating the Anunnaki's minions from you. This procedure was done with velvet gloves, but needed a more forceful approach. We intended with the ancient families, selected royals and their secret society's approval to quickly dispose of them by sending them to a special series of alternative realities. This process was intended to permit enlightened souls to swiftly proceed with the delivery and education required to give you your blessings. Instead, this present morass is what occurred. As these various difficulties unravel, it is becoming increasingly apparent that this transition period can take longer to start, but we have observed how quickly you adapt to new realities once they truly manifest. As a people, you are most resilient. It's those who have indelibly become a part of any cultural reality that are most unwilling to change. Thus, we continue to oversee what is occurring and wish that we had more of an important part in this rather drawn-out process. At present, all major transfers of funds by our earthly counterparts are completed. This operation in itself was very drawn out. In our view, the security insisted upon was above and beyond all requirements. Nevertheless it was done, and the next step is delivery. Those involved with this process are again being too timid for their own good. Despite this, we now expect this to happen relatively quickly. This procedure is to be just the start of events that are to forever change your reality. This procedure is reaching a point where the first of many events that you have long waited for can happen. This process has had its pace quickened, as each of you has begun to think collectively. This joint effort is about to be rewarded. The first part of a massive delivery is ready. What remains is the slow deliberateness of those in charge. While all this is happening, the last thrusts of the Dark's minions go on. The New Year promises to be one in which a whole host of long-announced promises at last come true. The deliveries of the first items look to happen before your Xmas. Use this first flurry of activity as a sign that some truly fantastic events are on the near horizon. We are readying a series of things that are but the first items in our parcels of goodies. Our intent is to see the rise of new governance and the ending of a long and vicious UFO cover-up. It is time you were told of our existence and benevolence. The long link between us needs to be freely revealed. Blessings and Grace we are your ascended masters. Many wonderful things are now happening. The funds from both the trust funds and the ancient families are being released and sent to their destinations. We bless and send hallelujahs to all concerned. The dark may try, as they always do, to trip up these schedules. However, 
These monies are just the start of a wave of funds that are to shower this realm with heaven's blessings. As you receive these funds, count your blessings and then use your inner grace to help your families, friends, and others. Use these funds to fulfill your dearest dreams and to allow others to likewise start to realize theirs. This glorious period includes Xmas and the New Year. It as well includes new governance and a new reality filled with joy, prosperity, and above all, your freedom. This is to be a most magnificent time to thank heaven and thank all for these most wondrous gifts. Around this globe is a vast rise in spiritual energies at this year's end. This energy is contributing to the positive acceleration of those goals set for this time by heaven. You know at this time of the year, we masters go to a number of sacred points around this world, like Mount Shasta and the sacred valleys of the Himalayas to pray, to envision, and to celebrate this new reality that is now taking hold. This divine energy is raising your consciousness and permitting a new era of light and love to descend upon Gaia. We ask you to take in these truly divine energies and use your inner grace to rise up this realm. Come together to praise and celebrate the wonders of heaven, as this new prosperous age becomes a reality. Let us come together as one. Let us accept our divine gifts and graciously spread these across this globe. Many millennia ago, we were all caught in the crosshairs of a grand dilemma. The dark had begun to openly defy heaven. Their vile plan was at first delayed and then banished by our heavenly administrators. We followed the grand instructions of these sacred heavenly hosts and developed a means to spread mercy to a great number of our ancestors. The heinous minions of the Anunnaki were slowly thwarted from their grand design to demand total obedience. Now we are on the very precipice of victory. We bless and graciously thank heaven for their works. Remain positive and join us in the last part of manifesting the great vision that Gaia gave us so long ago. The time has come to shout inwardly and with great zeal how full of love and light we are for those in both heaven and earth who make us so triumphant. Hosanna! 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 Today, we carried on with our weekly report. Much good is now occurring throughout this globe. A great movement that is to lead to your victory has begun. Throw out your numerous frustrations and rejoice. Things are now occurring that is to make the end of this year joyous. Know, dear ones, that the countless supply and never-ending prosperity of heaven are indeed yours. So be it. Selamat Gajan. Selamat Ya, Syrian for B1. And be in joy. Channeled by Sheldon Nidal www.paoweb.com